Yo, what is up, my crazy subscriber? This is Joe King Johnson before here, bringing you guys game number two of season two of the Madden Ultimate Team series. And uh, what happened in this game is pretty much pathetic because the game ended way too early. Now, straight ahead, guys, I'm gonna tell you, this is just a test. This is just a good test for my offense and defense since I picked up new players. As you can see, Brandon Browner, Sean Smith, Vontae's perfect. My old line, if you guys saw it right now, they were all over 85 overall, so we're going to be able to see some good-ass running plays. And um, also, the punt, return, the punt return, we got CJ Speller. If you guys return back into my week one video, I didn't have none of these players. They were pretty much right after the playoff game when I told you guys I was just pissed off and, you know, I didn't want to have nothing to do with anything else. Just play another game and show the world how I was supposed to win. And pretty much I won that game 21 to uh, 14. That's what happened. And this game I actually won it because my opponent had cheap ass Wi-Fi. I'm surprised that hap that that is happening on the next gen because you can afford a $400 console, but yet you cannot afford super high speed internet. How the fuck does that work? <laughs> How does that work? I mean, 400 bucks right there down the drain, and then you cannot not even afford the internet. I mean, come on, my man. So, anyways. Small taste of my offense and defense right now. I'm going to go on defense. I'm the 49ers, by the way. Vontae's perfect. Drop it to the left side. Nothing's going on. Brandon Browner thrown straight at him. He jumps into him. Like, that's impressive to me because my other corners will never do that. If you guys saw my playoff game, none of my corners ever did that on the slants going on to the, towards the outside. So, yeah, I was impressed by that move of Brandon Browner. I gave him an A-plus in the performance of this little drive right here because my, none of my corners never did that. And also, my DT got another sack. Linville Joseph is a beast, and he's only 79 overall. If you guys saw every single game before this of my series, though, Joking Giants and 4, he has been getting sacks like crazy, and he's also a great run stopper. I suggest to get him. He does have a lot of block chain, by the way. Anyways, oh, and by the way, watch the punt return. CJ Spiller to the right. Nobody's gonna get him. He's way too fast. Oh, Duke is ass out. Duke is ass out. Another Duke. Triple Duke. Damn. 30 yards with CJ Spiller. I suggest to get him. If you guys don't know how to get CJ Spiller, you gotta play the solo challenge of the Buffalo Bills. Complete the whole regular season. They'll give you CJ Spiller for free. You won't have to spend any kind of coins or anything on the auctions or cards, whatever. You know, just get him off the solo challenge. It's not that hard. If you got like a 75 overall and higher team, you should go to complete a regular season by the by, by now. So, anyways, I'm an offense. My O line did kind of little bit impress me though. Kind of alright. I gave him like a B minus performance though. I was kind of upset that my power was still not working off the I formation, so I ended up going into my uh, my favorite uh, run play, which is off the pistol uh, pistol something. What's the name of the pistol white trips? There it is. Pistol white trips. And all it did was the power that you saw on the bottom. That's one of my favorite runs because both guards pull out, which allows me to get a little bit of extra yards because they push out one of the linebackers and they push out either the safety or the other linebacker, which pretty much gives me an open field. So there it is, my final run. Pretty much an impressive run. I wish I wanted to see. I wanted to see more. I wanted to see if my running back can actually run like 40 fucking yards or 50 yards with this new O-line that I have, but my opponent connection was lost. Thanks for buying fucking Wi-Fi. You can afford a $400 console, but you cannot afford super high-speed internet. Come on, bro. So anyways, that's my game, guys. I ended up getting the W because my opponent connection sucked ass. So I'm 2-0. Not the way I wanted it, but I accept it. You know, 2-0. Hopefully, we can go undefeated this season, guys. Just like last year, my first season, where I actually went 10-0. So if you guys want to see more Madden 15 Ultimate Team, make sure you subscribe for more here in Madden All-Stars. And also, Mr. Joe King Johnson.